we're always trying to push the boundary on products and such. Our initial focus is on LEDs. How can we make and find LEDs that meet the needs of the plants? So we're currently testing on some of the new, um, their Cree type LEDs, which are creeping up into the 40% efficiency range. High intensity ma mammoth amount of light that are coming out and checking the different spectral to find the ideal quality that is required for the plants. Um, we're also trying to test out methodologies to try to cool these so we can have the lights closer to the plants. Um, trying to make it as uniform as possible. Um, growing plants as they move around is a bit of a challenge, so how do I maintain these uniformity? So light is our primary focus. Secondary issues is we're trying to test substrates. Currently we're using rock wool like everyone else does, but that is not an overly sustainable system. It's spun glass basically, and we can't compost and we need to go to something that is organic based. Um, we're also looking at different varieties and cultivars of plants that meet the, the consumers want. So red colorations of plants, um, gr other greens, leafy greens, anything else that can possibly be used on this. We potentially can go into the fruiting type plants, so the tomatoes, strawberries potentially out of these. Um, and then we're also looking at kind of temperature uh, control system, CO2 control system. So when I talked about the holistic market of it, it's that we're looking at all the different factors, focusing on the energy, but also on the quality.